I'm Shahrizat Abu Jalil. I'm the candidate for Barisan National Kawasan Parlimen Lembah Pantai. Beautiful and blessed Kawasan Parlimen. Um, I hope to win uh, for this general election because there's so much more that we need to do for the whole country, for the people, especially for our young. And guess who? you know, makes up human capital development in this country. It's our people. You know, for the first time in a long time, great emphasis has been given. So I hope that, you know, all the Rakyat Malaysia, no matter where you are, which age group you belong to, there is a place for you in the strategic and development uh, planning of the country. So go for it. Vote for Barisan National you know, for yourself, for your family, for your community, and for this country. And I'm one of them. If and when I win, I will make sure that you are not left behind. If you're from Lima Pantai, I hope you will give your vote of confidence to me to lead Lima Pantai with other representatives in our beautiful and blessed Kawasan Parliament. You know, today, Lima Pantai is the jewel in the crown. It is a microcosm of everything that Malaysia stands for. It's multiracial, multi-ethnic, we have the rich, the professionals, the not so rich. It's such a beautiful constituency. And guess what? It did not happen by accident. My team and I, together with other representatives in the Kawasan, we have worked very hard, very diligently, because I take my job seriously. And I know that in Mapantai, you need a strong support, a team, plus the support of the government. If you don't come with this kind of backing, it's going to be a tough ride for the people in Mapantai. Because the development we have brought in needs maintenance. We are going into next phase of development because I want to make sure that Mapantai it's a very exciting and thriving residential com uh, community and also a metropolitan. My dream is that you know we have the best infrastructure, the best that's happening in the world must happen and come to Lemah Pantai because the people are just beautiful. Thank you for always being there for me as I have been there for you. As Minister for Women, Family and Community Development, I have been entrusted to look after this target group, women, family, children, the disabled, senior citizens, I look after welfare issues and social development. We at the ministry say we look after you know people from the cradle to the grave. Uh, it's been uh, very exciting and challenging, but the greatest joy uh, for me is that we've been able you know, to improve on our laws, on our rules and our regulations. The first thing I did as a you know, as a person who had training in law, I was a corporate lawyer for many years. In fact, I was with government as well. I was a magistrate. I was assistant treasury solicitor. I practice, and uh, I know how important it is, you know, for this country to have, you know, good, strong, and sound laws, uh, regulations, policies. So the first thing I did uh, when I became minister was to persuade the government to amend the federal constitution, Article. Eight specifically states now that uh, there shall be no discrimination based on gender and after that we have been auditing all the laws and rules and policies and uh, this is you know an effort by the Barisan National Government and we have also been working seriously on issues affecting you know senior citizens and you would have also known that last year has been an incredible year for you know your family members who are disabled one way or the other because finally the Akta Orang Kurang Upaya or Persons with Disabilities Act got, went to Parliament and we are going to make sure under Barisan National, uh, Malaysia is a barrier-free country. There is a place even for the disabled, especially for the disabled actually. So we've done many exciting things and uh, there's a lot, a lot more to be done. I hope you will you know, give me the vote because uh, I will make sure that all these things receive you know, the highest attention.